and uh, welcome to today's competition. It's uh, interleague interstate action <laughs> as Ratner takes on the uh, Garden City Trojans, which uh, is up uh, off of Long Island, I believe. I'm sitting here reading uh, GardenCitySports.com. The Garden City Girls lacrosse team is gearing up for an electrifying start of uh, their 2024 season as they prepare to journey to Pennsylvania this weekend. Uh, they'll face off against the Radnor High School team. Uh, with their eyes firmly set on the prize, the Trojans narrowly missed clinching the state championship last year as finalists and are hungry for redemption and determined to make up their mark on a fiercely competitive landscape of New York lacrosse. But of course, they came to Pennsylvania. So these are gonna be two uh, evenly matched teams. Uh, the girls did play uh, Twin Valley, which was another uh, championship team from uh, Lancaster area of Pennsylvania, and uh, that was a, they were uh, well matched. Uh, they did win, um, but uh, Twin Valley did keep them going the entire time. So, uh, two to four inches of rain are predicted for today, uh, and winds all at the height of the uh, game here. So, the team was originally supposed to be on a Necky field next door. That's flooded, so they moved here to the main stadium. The girls will have a uh, lunch. Riders hosting uh, um, Garden City for a lunch afterwards in the cafeteria. It was supposed to be in the nest, but the uh, rain has moved it. Um, they uh, also did a, uh, it was a field hockey game they played against a school from England. Uh, which was neat. The girls had a blast uh, afterwards, having a little pizza party. It was over on Memorial Field. So uh, it's nice to play with people that are uh, not from your area, that you don't get to see often, and then have a nice little uh, celebratory uh, chit chat afterwards. Baseball all the way over there.
opens it up. <coughs> Scoring the first. I will say the dedicated fan award <coughs> excuse me, goes to this gentleman here. And uh, these two people over here. Everybody else is huddled up top here like wallflowers up against the wall. Gonna head down during the uh, second period and uh, get uh, some still shots. I'll walk around the field. Twenty-nine uh, left in the uh, in the period here. Not that it makes a difference, but I think the rain has kind of started to come down just a little bit harder. Swing and a miss. Ball. High to the left hand side. Garden City has the ball. Or Heading back down. Garden City, I guess they scored twice. It is now Radner 1, Garden City 2, and really the the image of the day 
is that. All the girls huddled in the tents trying to keep dry. Uh, the one tent has uh, inverted itself due to the uh, due to the weather here just to give you a, a uh, little bit of a background as to the weather we're getting here. Um, I will add this uh, field here that we're in, uh, Prevo Stadium was just all recently redone and they, I don't know, they dug down 50 feet and put in a a stormwater something 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 to prevent the field from flooding and I will say it's uh, it's doing a pretty good uh, job there. Um, the field is uh, relatively dry as relatively dry goes. Um, of course if you're watching this at home that means nothing to you but trust me when I say the field is relatively dry that's a that's a compliment to the uh, designers. Usually they store water management something in this town and don't do this good of a job, so I give them credit where credit is due. Then during the second period, I'm going to be down on the field getting some stills. Oh, face plant. She's going home wet. Two ten left on the clock. Shot and score by Garden City, uh, 121 left in the first period. The score is now Garden City Trojans 3, Radner 1. As we're coming down, uh, we're back to some Garden City sports for some interlude here. Uh, for the Trojans, this weekend clash against the Radnor High School represents more than just a mere game. It's a chance to lay down the gauntlet and set the tone for the season ahead. Uh, with a roster boasting a potent mix of seasoned veterans and promising newcomers, the Trojans are primed to unleash their full arsenal skills and tactics on the field. Well, they definitely have a nifty uh, sports writer for them. I believe even though this is out of league, it, it does count for uh, standings here in the Central League. Because um, it's not a preseason, it's not a scrimmage. So uh, this will be a win or a loss uh, in Radner's cap. Uh, I'm not sure how the New York Athletic Association um, runs their rules. 
103 left. Four to one. Wagner uh, lacrosse is also getting ready to gear up. They're headed to Florida tomorrow morning. Hopefully all their gear will dry out. We'll be taking place in a competition down there. Uh, leaving tomorrow, coming back Thursday, I believe. Hopefully it'll be a little less rainy for them. Definitely won't be as cold. I should mention today is currently a, uh, you know 42 degrees monsoon rains. Although the winds are, are slight. The winds are not an issue today. Yet. And at the half, or at the end of the first quarter, it is Garden City for Radner 2. All right, we're back after uh, going down, taking some stills during the second. 3-4. Uh, Radner did uh, get some points back. That would have been the uh, period to record, but as they say, Oops. One of the uh, girls from Dryden City. Yeah. Asked me uh, what Instagram account the photos were going on, and I'm like, uh, none, lady, I don't Instagram. So I'll send them to your coach, you can Instagram the photos yourself.
3.35 left on the clock. Score is still Radner 3. Garden City 4. Sorry about that. I will say as I was down there on the field, the $10 billion that they spent to prevent the field from flooding is working rather nice. End of the third, it is 4-3. situated here with our candy dandy super deluxe rain cover. Alright.
saved there by uh, uh, Garden Valley. in this competition. The crowd goes water, water, the crowd goes water. The crowd goes wild or they needed a reason to shake all the rain water off of them.
Man, the girls are definitely screaming. I don't know if that's joy, excitement, or that they're freezing. Now I know where the ball is. There's the ball. City. They get the ball, they're heading back down. 7.38 left in this competition. Saved by Arden here yeah, for Radner. The rain is still coming down. Garden City, 5-4, uh, 557 left in this uh, competition in the fourth period here. The crowd is huddled under cover with a few dedicated people. down there low.
Saved there by Garden City. 424 left in the competition. Two thirteen left on the clock. All right, time out with 129 left on the clock here. 5 4. <coughs> the rain is still coming down. Original thought was a uh, lunch over there at the uh, at the nest, which is the little uh, outdoor viewing pavilion over there, um, with water ice and the such. But I think we're having hot chocolate inside now. Ah. <sighs>
back here somewhere. 121 left on the clock we said. Seventeen point nine seconds left on the clock. Uh, Garden City Trojans still up by one. At the end of this competition, it is Garden City Atrocians 5, Radner 4. Alright, so here's here's the insider. So you're a Garden oh. City person? <laughs> <laughs> you were born in Garden City? Yes, born in Garden City. Yeah, and Garden City is in Long Island, if I uh, did Long my research Island? correctly. Yes, that yes, is yes, correct. Yes. That is correct. And uh, you were a Wait, Spartan? Trojan. Close. Tro Trojan. Trojan. I was calling Which them Spartans. Had a, a it's the same damn head, isn't it? Spartans, yes, Trojans? Yes. Oops. Yes. All right. And you so, played lacrosse there? I did. All right. And your <laughs> cousin is the coach? Cousin's the coach. I have a niece on the team. I have... Friends, kids on the team. Yeah, so it was. Uh, so, so is is uh, did you feed them inside information? Is this why nope, we lost? Nope. I any secret plays? I was very neutral. No, it's great game. Great game. Very evenly matched. Yeah. Someone had to win. Which Someone was right now. And uh, so you're the reason why we're playing them? No, actually, I don't. Th I don't think I could take credit. I don't think I could take credit. Yes. Hi. Another a Brooklyn Island. girl. No, Brooklyn, don't Brooklyn. say Long Island. <laughs> Brooklyn girl, yeah. And what's what's the difference between Brooklyn and Long Island? Brooklyn City. Bro Brooklyn is more a b at the beginning, and but. Long Island is more of a g. At Brooklyn the end, has a little yeah. bit more attitude. Uh, yes. Yeah. A little bit more tude. A little more street smart. A little bit more street starts. Yeah, and, and you, not, not you got a little bit smarts. more, a right. little bit more class yeah. in, in Garden City in Long Island. Yeah, just, just, just a little, you know. If I had to go into a fight, I might take Cindy with me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> I'm yes. from Newtown Square. I didn't move far. <laughs> uh, 